I was asked by the mayor of Punta Gorda Tom, Mr. Salgado, to contribute towards the, the mural and put from the family side what we'd want to see out there. And um, I believe that it's about time that they honored Mrs. Leila Brennan for all her contribution to the nation of Belize. We are honored that she has uh, a place in, in town where they can see her face and remember her good deeds. Um, however, I think it came a little bit too late, but we are still very honored to have her as a part, a major part of this town. With the portrait being put up, was it a selection process for you? Were you the one who selected that portrait that is being painted? Yes, I sure did. Um, I think it captured the essence of who Miss Leela was. It showed part of her uh, Creole heritage, but a little part of her uh, Maya heritage too, because she's both those. Um, her mother was um, Miss Miss Genos, who was Creole, and her father was a Maya. So um, Mr. Alfredo Martinez. So she's a mix of those people, but she identified herself as a Belize Creole. We came up with the idea of having Miss Leela's portrait out there. And I believe that Miss Leela is a legendary, like what you said. And I believe that she, it is time that somebody recognizes her, her contribution to the music world. And as a matter of fact, to Punda Gorda. Because Miss Leela, Miss, Leela, Miss Leela was a very famous person here in PG. And I, and this council then believe that she has contributed a lot to Toledo and um, we wanted to do that mural in her honor so um, we had consulted with the family and they gave us the okay and um, that's is how we proceed in having that mural in her honor and as a matter of fact we um, we are contemplating um, to rename that Central Park um, Miss Leela Vernon Central Park as well uh, to recognize the good work that she has done for this community and in a whole Belize.